652, here's what you need to know before you go this morning. Starting today, every adult in Texas is able to register for the COVID-19 vaccine. This is the first opportunity for many in the community who do not meet the criteria of being 65 and older or having an underlying health condition. While an adult can register, El Paso County Judge Ricardo Samaniego is still asking young and healthy El Pasoans to wait if you can to let the older, more vulnerable population go first. And El Paso COVID-19 monoclonal antibody infusion treatments will now happen at the hospitals of Providence Memorial Campus. Since November 2020, 2,211 El Pasoans have received the infusion treatments through the city of El Paso and Border Rack. However, on March 31st, the city will do its last infusion treatment and the treatments from now on will be done at the hospitals of Providence. Take a look at the coronavirus numbers today. The El Paso Department of Health is reporting four more COVID-related deaths today. That brings the death total up to 2,374. There are also 92 new positive cases. The total number of cases to date over 129,000. While active cases remain above the 2,000 mark, the recovery rate remains at 96%. For more information on these and all the day's top stories, go to our website, ktsm.com.